Hey everybody, it's Megan and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to give you guys an Aldi haul. I've been to Aldi in such a long time. I've actually only been once and this time I took the boys with me and they're awesome because they have a double cart. Um, like the seats for the kid area is like Costco where it's two of them. So I got to keep them contained and was able to get a bunch of stuff. So I spent $160 and this is what I got for it. So this is all of it. Um, there is like, if there's a box of mac and cheese, I got like four of them, so that's not on there. Um, but everything else is right here. Oh, in a case of water and two Gatorades. Um, that won't fit here. But this is everything. So I'm gonna start at the front and work my way back. This will get us through different things, get us through more. Um, it's a family of four, it's what I have. Um, two, a four year old, a two and a half year old, my husband and I, so. Let's start in front. We needed the big, like freezer storage gallon bags so i got one that's freezer and one that's just storage but they're the ones with the little slide things which is awesome now the most expensive thing i bought was under ten dollars and that was this meat over here so all the definitely good prices for what you can find everything there it's summertime so we stocked up on some sunscreen this is the spray sport 50 i get the biggest one because very pale very pale kids and very pale husbands so um i also get the rubbing kind because liam does not like the spray he likes the liquid and so i just rub it on him so just got basic 50 for both of those then we needed some more hand soaps so i just got like three little hand soaps um the clear and i think this one is like the moisturizing for mine i love cranberry juice so i got the cran cranberry juice and i make sure to get the 100 percent juice not the cocktail because the cocktail has more sugar in it and um, that's pretty much i'm the only one that'll drink this i mix this with orange juice and it's really yummy needed some more little wipes so just the disinfectant wipes just got the big one of lemon then over here we have some spring mix salad we also have some tortellini these are really good to cook up just a few for my lunches and then with a salad perfect lunch right there got the boys some little cheesy cracker snacks there's 12 little pouches in here, um, just like the Ritz cracker ones. Then over here, just some garden salad. I like to get a mix of many different types of lettuce because there's also some spinach over here. I just like to mix it up to, for salads. Then for the boys, I got those cheesy crackers and then I got these little cheese crack little dips. Um, they're not the super like most healthy, but it's really good for like on the go at the park. Got some little frozen burritos if I need a quick lunch for myself or my husband got some um, sour cream and chives potatoes just the quick potatoes if i need a side dish we go through quite a bit of cheese so i got two big things of the mexican blend cheese for quesadillas like these tortillas um another side dish just the mashed potatoes baby reds these are really yummy we are out of white rice so it's always good to have some white rice like i said quesadillas tacos burritos with these tortillas um, I'm trying out this spinach herb wrap so that I can have a wrap for my lunch instead of using actual bread so it's a little bit healthier for myself. So I'm going to try these out. Got some blueberries. These are Nolan's favorite. He will eat this whole entire container if I let him in one sitting, but I don't. Then got some seasoning packets. So we got some ranch chipotle and some ranch bacon. These are really good to put on chicken and bake it really really yummy like i said mac and cheese um i did get four boxes but i didn't put them all here right now another snack for the boys and for myself are these little like cheese it type crackers not the cheese it brand so it was cheaper but they will taste exactly the same we were out of parmesan cheese so i got some parmesan cheese got a thing of celery for snacks um liam wants to make ants on a log so we will do that with celery peanut butter and raisins um, I told Liam about a spaghetti squash and he wanted to try it. So we got a spaghetti squash. I will cook this up in a few days. Um, I'm not sure how to tell if they're like ready and good to go, but I made it before and we'll see what they think of it. Got some hot dogs, just basic hot dogs. These are good, quick lunch if I need something quick for the boys. Got a bunch of different yogurts. So we got blueberry, strawberry, there's strawberry banana. I think there is like a cherry one um, and then strawberry and blueberry. Got some fish sticks, just bake regular basic breaded fish sticks. Yes, I know, breaded, It's but you know what? Kids can indulge every once in a while. Got some little pepperonis. Um, the kids just love to have this with some cheese, just 
like as a lunch or a dinner. Like they just love little pepperonis. So got some pepperonis. Like I said, the most expensive thing I bought was this. These are ribs. They were $9. So, I mean, it's a good hunk of, good hunk of meat there. For a treat, got a thing of strawberry ice cream and a thing of chocolate ice cream. This will last us quite a while because we don't eat tons of ice cream. To go with that spaghetti squash, got some spicy garlic spaghetti sauce. And then I think this is just like normal, yeah, vegetable spaghetti sauce. Then another piece of meat was a pork tenderloin. I'm usually the only one that really likes this, but my husband will eat it kind of if I make him. Um, but that's lemon garlic. I love pork tenderloin. Some little fruit green bars. These are awesome to have in the diaper bag to take for snacks at the park or just for snacks in general. So we got the blueberry kind and we got the strawberry kind. We also got some veggie chips. The boys love these. Really good to go with lunches. And then for breakfast, quick breakfast, are these cinnamon toast, French toast sticks. They love these. This is a different brand, so I never tried this brand, but I got two boxes of those. Got some carne asada type meat where it's already marinated. We just barbecue it or cook it up in a pan. Um, An awesome price, so that's good for tacos. Got a big thing of ground beef. Um, yes, this one is, I believe, 73.27 for fat, lean fat. Um, I do like it with a little bit more fat in it. It tastes better to me. Um, so then I will split this up and then I will freeze it. So it'll be three different meals from this one big chunk. We got some bagels. We love bagels, especially right now being pregnant. I have to have breakfast. And so this is good. I know it's carbs, but I'm making a baby, so it doesn't matter. Um, so we got everything, and then we got plain. The boys love bagels as well, and they will each eat a bagel. So we go through these things pretty darn quick. Some frozen chicken breasts. I like to put these just in the oven or in my Instant Pot now with some of seasonings, or it's just really good to have some frozen chicken on hand for a quick dinner. And a thing of paper plates. Yes, it's more waste, but every once in a while it's really good to have these on hand quick and easy. Then two loaves of bread. I got the honey wheat and the whole wheat. We don't do white bread. The boys are totally fine with wheat bread and they eat the crusts, so I don't even have to cut crusts off. We got some little Fruit Loops or Fruit Rounds. They taste the same as Fruit Loops and they are cheaper. And then we got, the last few things we got, a thing of tomatoes for salads, and Liam loves tomatoes. He will have like six of these with dinner. Um, so we go through that pretty quick. And some bananas, lots of bananas, and they are nice and green, so they will last a while. And then I can probably turn some of them into banana bread if they don't eat them. So that is what I got at Aldi. Um, like I said, I spent $160, and some of this stuff will get us through for a while. Other things they eat pretty fast but that's just what happens when you have two growing boys. So if you like this video, give it a big thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already to join the Days of May family because this is happening. If you haven't seen all my pregnancy updates, make sure to go watch those. Hope you're having an amazing day. Leave me a comment. I love to hear what you guys have to say, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.